Benicio del Toro emerged in the mid-1990s as one of the most watchable and charismatic character actors to come along in years. A favorite of film buffs, del Toro gained mainstream public attention as the conflicted but basically honest Mexican policeman in Steven Soderbergh's Traffic, 2000 Benicio was born on February 19, 1967 in San German, Puerto Rico, the son of lawyer parents Fausta Genoviva Sanchez Rivera and Gustavo Adolfo del Toro Bermudez. His mother died when he was young, and his father moved the family to a farm in Pennsylvania. A basketball player with an interest in acting, he decided to follow the family way and study business at the University of California in San Diego. A class in acting resulted in his being bitten by the acting bug, and he subsequently dropped out and began studying with legendary acting teacher Stella Adler in Los Angeles and at the Circle in the Square Acting School in New York City. Telling his parents that he was taking courses in business, Del Toro hid his new studies from his family for a little while. During the late 1980s, he made several television appearances, most notably in an episode of Miami Vice 1984, and in the NBC miniseries Drug Wars, The Camarena Story 1990. Del Toro's big-screen career got off to a slower start, however his first role was Duke the Dog-Faced Boy in Big Top Pee Wee 1988. However, things looked better when he landed the role of Dario, the vicious henchman in the James Bond film License to Kill, 1989. Surprising his co-stars at age 21, Del Toro was the youngest actor ever to portray a Bond villain. However, the potential break was spoiled as the picture turned out to be one of the most disappointing Bond films ever. This was lost amid bigger summer competition. Benicio gave creditable performances in many overlooked films for the next several years, such as The Indian Runner 1991, Christopher Columbus, The Discovery 1992, and Money for Nothing 1993. His roles in Fearless 1993 and China Moon 1994 gained him more critical notices, and 1995 proved to be the first year of Benicio as he gave a memorable performance in Swimming with Sharks, 1994, before taking critics and film buffs by storm as the mumbling, mysterious gangster in The Usual Suspects, 1995, directed by Brian Singer. Del Toro won an Independent Spirit Award for Best Supporting Actor for the role in the Oscar-winning film. Staying true to his independent roots, he next gave a charismatic turn as cold-blooded gangster Gaspar Spaglia in The Funeral, 1996, directed by Abel Ferrara. He also appeared as Benny Dalmau in Basquiat, 1996, directed by artist friend Julian Schnabel. That year also marked his first truly commercial film, as he played cocky Spanish baseball